All right, y'all ready for this? Actually, no, I don't want to start that one. That's my best time, so I'm going to keep it that way. Okay, I'm just going to skip through all this because... Unnecessary. Uh-huh, uh-huh, she's broken. Uh, okay, fixed her. Okay, now yeah, she's okay. Okay, she's... She had, like, one sick day, and now she's there, like, okay, go on a mission. Okay. Yep, 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 thank you, thank you. And we have left off. Yes, thank you. Thank you for letting me know where I'm going. Even though you already marked it on the map for me to go to. Nailed the jump. Nailed the jump. Unfortunate news. Oh boy. Yes, yes. Yes, thank you. Now that I think about it, I don't think those dialogue boxes count as game time. I guess is nice. Sales. Oh, overshot that one a little bit. Not me to jump. <clears throat> yes. 
Yes. Give it to me. No, it took too long. Yes. Oh, I didn't grab the stupid red X thing. So now I have less missiles. Now I'm going to have even less missiles. It's okay, I guess. Want to keep at least three missiles. Feels like someone's touching my hair, but I'm just going to ignore it. More missiles, please. Nailed it. Oh, didn't nail that. The spooky scary. <laughs> Doesn't get any easier to see it, no matter how many times I do this. I did it. You missiles. I need as many E tanks as I can get because I'm actually going to not save until the very last save. Just to save time. I save time. Um, so, so that I don't die. Because if I die, then uh, I gotta start the whole game over. Which, I mean... 
rules for the speed run on speedrun.com it says you can't die I guess is fair because I, well, I mean if you die then you just lose a lot of time I'm already very much low on missiles. Oh, come on. I'm not gonna kill you. I'm not gonna waste my missile. Man, this is the first time, because usually I grab the, the missile upgrade in the lava room. So I, like, have five... I would have six missiles right now. Oh, come on, dude. Okay, that's good. So I am going to get this one over here. <clears throat> Having lots of missiles is good. Oh, she's a sick dodge. That sweet dodge. It's sick, nasty dodge. Oh, yes. Yes, missiles. Thank you. Dang it, I forgot. I just wasn't paying attention. I forgot about the door. Yes. Come to me. Oh. Press B button a little uh, early on that one. gonna get the missile upgrade down over there on the left. This just takes way too long. Oh, forgot to charge my laser. I didn't forget that one. I'm not gonna get the missile upgrade over there. I've already skipped three missile upgrades that I usually get. Should save some time. Objective is clear. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Women win their thoughts. I'm just kidding. Men have thoughts too, sometimes.
Da -da -da. Ich. Excuse me. Doing it. Oh, the bug does so much damage. that missile upgrade over there too. Not going for the missile upgrade up there. Oh, that one gave me a red one.
I think that was the fastest I've ever done that boss. Which, I mean, the boss isn't... It's not, like, that hard to do quick. Because it's, like, the same thing every time. I guess it's, it doesn't do the same number of jumps every time, but... It's really just up to being able to place yourself right, which isn't super hard to do. We'll get the missile upgrade in here, though. Objective is clear. No oh, more thoughts. is clear.
Oh. This is taking a long time. This is not so speedy of me. But not more than I hate the spider boss. I'm not going to get those missile upgrades. Ready for this speed run tactic? You don't even know. Yeah, look at that. Saved like so much time. I just didn't mean to jump there. Under sector three.
Man, so much dialogue in this game. Yes, thank you for letting me know everything about the wonders of the world. Speedrun. Speedrun tactic. No, I wanted to kill it <laughs> with the shine spark, but I messed up. Before I fight the boss, I'm actually probably going to hit the recharge station because I don't want to die. And knowing me and how many mistakes I make, I will probably die. Oh, dang it. Oh, that's too close. Oh, come on, man. pointing down. That was weird. Did it. We're in good shape. I actually have no idea if that's true because I'm not timing this. And there's my dog.
<coughs> Excuse me, sorry. I just muted my mic so I could just cough. No, get away. Get away. Oh, get away. <laughs> it's been a long time since I've been hit by one of those. Just not on my game. Oh, I missed. Shoot at the door that's already open. Yeah, good job. Really? None of you gave me missiles? That's cool. Oh. Oh! Fuck oh, yeah! Dude, so good. Alright, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out of here, get out of here, get out of here. Get out of here. I like the sound this boss makes. It sounds really cool. Got him. You'd think with super missiles, since they do like triple the damage of regular missiles, this would take less time, but no. No, 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 no. Nailed it. Oh, there was a second one. There was a second one hidden in the shadow of the first. Ten points to whoever gets that reference. And then minus ten points because you're a weeaboo.
Yes, the best missiles. I hate ice missiles. I hate them. Because with the super missiles, it's really awesome. Because you just one-shot everything. But the ice missile, you gotta freeze it. Then you gotta kill it. Waste my time. Waste of my time. <laughs> Thanks, Jordan. I will break that record. I know it for a fact. Because I'm skipping a lot of things that I usually do. <clears throat> I'm going for a PB right now. Peanut butter. Peanut, mm, peanut butter is delicious. Yes, thank you for letting me know everything. Experiment with those missiles. <laughs> Oh, I thought I was going to smash him. Look at this, look at this. Look, look at how quickly I can just run through that. On my way back, if I try to use Ice Missile, they freeze and it stops my movement. You're just talking about McDonald's and other countries? Your teacher sounds cool. I think I think in Japan they have uh, mixed spaghetti. Like it's just no, I went the wrong way. They have just a, like a it's like a box of instead of you get chicken nuggets, it's just a box of spaghetti. Honestly, it sounds kind of delicious. Yes, I think so. Yeah, this seems right. I don't know why I jumped. <clears throat> yeah, I guess in India they would have different things on the menu because they don't they don't have beef. Or I guess they don't eat beef because of a uh, Cows are sacred. God, I just, I'm a failure. I'm a failure. That's what I meant to do. Not fall. Hit that button. No. I hate that the door doesn't. It, like, the door, like, physically can't open fast enough to get you through. You have, you have to, like, hit it. Now just get out of my way. Do they have pork-related items at McDonald's? I mean, I guess, unless, like, their 100% beef patties actually have pork in them. Because they like to cut corners. Anything with bacon. Okay. Yeah, because I know they got the... The maple bacon Dijon uh, burger, which I do quite enjoy. What? 
Come on, dude. Grab the ledge. I know, dude. I want a maple bacon Dijon burger right now. It sounds delicious. I don't want to get Archibalds again, but I don't want to wait 25 minutes in the drive through That's how long it took. It's missiles. Are uh, you ready for the most ear-splittingly loud music? Well, I have the music turned down really low, so... But like at the climax of the sound, you can, it sounds like it's almost like clipping the whatever electronic microphone they used. I do work. I have work at 2, 2 to 10.30. Six minutes to kitty cat explosion. Yeah, I know it is gross. I don't want to do it, but money is what I need if I want to buy a car. No, I didn't mean. No, I didn't want to stand here. No, now I'm wasting time. Yeah, I know I have little time. I didn't mean to do that. Oh, it's Isaac. Brian Isaac. Yeah. Oh, get frozen. Get frozen. Oh, I didn't I didn't do it fast enough. No, I'm not already almost done. Uh I think I actually have, like, no idea, like, where the halfway point in the game is. Uh, I think I'm maybe halfway through the game now. Or maybe after I stop... Oh, dude, come on. After I, um... Get the boiler room uh, situated. I think that's, like, maybe the halfway point. Maybe? I have no idea. What, what time is it? Oh no, I destroyed the platform. There we go. It's 11.54. I'm pretty sure I'm halfway through the game. Because that's 50... Because I'm pretty sure I started at 11 o'clock. And that's 54 minutes real time. Uh, which real time and in-game time are super different. Because I don't think they count uh, dialogue boxes as being part of game time. Uh, and that's actually like kind of a lot of... Quite a few minutes of dialogue in the game, so I'll probably I'll probably once I turn this off and get back to the to the nav room, I'll probably be halfway done. Although I am going faster than usual, so maybe I am over halfway done. I don't know. I actually have no idea. Come on, dude. 
Oh, I guess I'm just gonna walk through the lava. Okay, okay, I'm okay. Oh, I thought I was gonna dodge it, but I didn't. Come on, dude, just jump. Jump. J I hate you. Is there a way to go this way? Oh, there is. Oh. Oh, God, that's so much faster. Do I skip something? I feel like I might skip, like, up there. Uh, what do I skip? Maybe I don't skip. I don't skip anything. No, that is a bit faster. I do have the various suit, uh, which is what let me go. Because when, when you saw that the background was all like super hot and red, it lets me go in there. Uh, but I can't just go in lava. Uh, you need the the gravity suit for that, which makes liquids not, like, slow you down. But I guess that also counts as, like, another suit upgrade in general. So it makes you more resistant. Uh, so that's when you can go in lava. And you don't move slow in lava either. <clears throat> yeah, otherwise, if I didn't have the various suit, if I was just in those rooms and not in the lava, I would be taking damage. Samus is bay, dude. She's like an awesome bounty hunter. Yeah, what's interesting is that even though this is Metroid 4 out of a lot, um, this is... I think people, I don't know if it's like confirmed or anything, but people say that this is the uh, last game in chronological order. Well, I guess I could just freeze it there. She is fun to play in Smash. <clears throat> I actually used to play Samus a lot in Brawl. These are the animals you save in Super Metroid, which is Metroid 3, which is the game before this. I've met these intelligence beings before. Yeah, it was in the last game. here. I'm like not even really paying attention to where I'm supposed to be going. Yes, yeah, sweet power bomb. I 
I will get the missile upgrade at the end of the hall. Because it's just nice and quick. Never have too many missiles. Kill the poor. That is what the X virus does. Only reason why the X can't kill me anymore is because uh, the X parasite is a uh, food for Metroids, and in the beginning sequence of the game, uh, they inject uh, Samus with a Metroid vaccine. No, all the X... Uh, all of the saxophone encounters are staged. They're uh, they're put there on purpose. Me? Oh, come on. Yeah, P-bombs. P-bomb, P-bomb, P-bomb. Oh, come on. This is a, this is an encounter with the same sex. See, you hear that? Yeah. The game wants you to like your first impression is to like, oh, I need a power bomb. But if you power bomb, this wall disappears. So uh, then the saw X can get you. Uh, but it's actually if you power bomb down there, it leads to nowhere. So you get stuck in there with the with the with the saxophone like behind you. Uh, which really sucks. And uh, that passageway that I took is actually the right way. <clears throat> yes, it is very clever. Game designers knew what they were doing. They wanted to make you scared. Oh, and also there's a spooky thing in the background. See that shadow that just flew by? That's uh, one of the bosses. There it is again. The gap between this game and Super Metroid was, like, huge. Like, I think Super Metroid came out in, like, the early, the early 90s or the mid-90s. And then this game came out in 2004. So it was, like, it's like 10 years, at least, between these games. Oh, and the power goes out. Oh, snap. It's Frozen Ridley. Oh, that 
X Parasite left. Maybe I can run through this. Yes! <laughs> yeah, really is a pretty bad dude. Is the coolest. I think he's like probably the coolest Metroid character. Other than Samus. Oh, I guess I saved. Okay. I mean, whatever. Yes, 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 yes. He was not put in Smash. Well, I mean, kind of. He's on one of the levels. Um, <clears throat> he's like part of the level environment. Excuse me. Man. Yes, yes, he thinks, yes. <clears throat> yeah, it's pretty cool. There's an X boss fight. I'm going to need like as many missiles as possible. Oh, come on. Dude. I mean, right now I can just keep using him because I'm going to replenish them anyway at the door. But this next boss fight is just it's a spam. You gotta spam those missiles. Come on. Yes! I've pretty much every door's been like pretty good. Alright. I really only have fifty missiles, man. I did skip a lot. Come on, man. Your mouth. I hate this boss. This boss also does like a buttload of damage. So I don't want to touch it. Come on, dude. That's the part I hate. Actually, gonna try to just use the energy beam. Always oh, red. Oh, baby, a triple. Oh, shot a little too early. Yeah, there are a lot of 360s, because he gives you the space jump. He is pretty crabby, actually. It's supposed to be a spider, though. See, because now I can space jump. Skew. <laughs> it's like Macho Man. 360! And this next part is scary. Or at least it was scary like the first time I did it. 
Because uh, uh, I beat the first time I beat this game, I had to use a guide because this game is just like crazy convoluted. Everything is convoluted. Um, uh, yeah, maybe it is insane. You have to go through a, a saxophone chase. So you gotta freeze it and you gotta run. Then it follows you. So you gotta keep freezing it. You gotta powerball the wall. And it shoots you and it hurts a lot. See ya. Later. It doesn't follow you after that. Excuse me. Every time I get to this part, I get kind of... It's kind of like... I'm not super sure where I'm supposed to be going. Um, but like now I'm starting to remember where I'm supposed to go. Yeah, you gotta go in here. Because this is where... You get the plasma beam, which is like strongest beam. Well, it's not the strongest in this game. Uh, usually, <laughs> now the the saxophone can ball form. Because it, it goes in a ball form to use the power bomb in that one room. Uh, I don't know if you were here for it, uh, but he used it there. I need to like. Maybe I should have got more missiles. I'm stupid. Cause like I still need missiles to kill the the boss afterwards. We did it. <laughs> okay. I guess I'll see in a little bit. I'm not going to beat the game before you do that, so. Good luck. There's an energy tank in here, so I'm going to get it. So pretty much want to get every single one that I can feasibly get quickly. That explosion was caused by the shadow thing I pointed out earlier. A bird is going off in the background.
Yes, thank you. Thank you. No, no, not up there. I always feel compelled to go up there, I don't know why. No, bad door. No, bad door. that one. Okay. Oh man, he's up too high. No, it was up too high. I could have done it, but I didn't. <gasps> no, why are you over there? No, this is taking too long. Power bombs hurt him? Doesn't seem like they do. God, I'm a failure. I did it. Best of you to return in my time of messing up really bad. I blew him up. Now we're in sector four. You missed me uh, going through the broken version of the Arctic. Went the wrong way. Um of the arctic place where i told you that the shadow in the background was one of the bosses that's the thing i just killed um and now i and then i went to the boss and then i killed it and now here i am
Blam, 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 blam. Yes, it is very freaky looking. It's like a... I think the point of it was that it was like a, a biomechanical weapon, which is why it was like a robot. And also, when I started to kill it more, it became like really gross looking. And like... Uh, like... What's the... Organic. It started to look more organic as I started to kill it. It came fleshy. Alright, that should be enough E tanks for the end of the game, just so just in case like I, if I mess up I'm not gonna die. I mean I still could die because the last boss does like a lot of damage. And I'm just not very good at avoiding damage, because I just, I'm just not. Biohazard battle. I think I know what you're talking about. I can do the skip. Oh my god, I did it! <laughs> I did the skip! Where do I go from here now? I don't remember. Or no, that's not the skip. Wait, what? Wait. Oh, okay, that's right. I'm just supposed to go under the thing. No, stop. I just want to grab the thing. It's like Contra if you went sideways, not up. Contra goes sideways. It's a 2D side scroll like this. Contra does have segments where they go up, though. Or I guess forward in your field. Your depth of field. Dang it, I just I'm stupid. I'm stupid. Shouldn't have got that close. I'm getting pretty close to the end of the game now. You pilot a vehicle. In Contra, you do not pilot a vehicle. Contra, you're just, you're an army dude. Or are you talking about biohazard battle as you pilot a vehicle? In Gradius, you are a spaceship in space, and you move, like, you're constantly moving to the right, but you can move up, down, left, and right on the screen as you, in, as new things income into your, your uh, I guess, your view. Okay, yeah. Uh, Game Grumps played Gradius. They played Gradius 3. 
And then they also played Parodius, which is a, like a spoof version of the game. Where Aaron, like, sharded himself because he got so angry. Yeah, I got you. No entry without authorization. Oh no, there's an explosion. What's happening? What's happening? <gasps> it's the rogue security bot. Oh man, I am like a machine. Nope, oh, just messed that one up. Oh yes. Oh yes. Yes, daddy. Well, that one goes fast. So this one gives you the wave beam, which is a beam that lets your beam go through walls. I don't know what that robot had anything to do with being able to pass through walls. Like, at all. But, you know what? Whatever. It's... It's a good beam. Good beam. Excuse me. The game, like, lagged there for a second. Restricted lab. There's Metroids here. <gasps> and look, it's the saxophone. Saxophone's fighting the Metroids. Now the Metroids are killing that saxophone. Because Metroids like to eat the X Parasite, and they're like, hmm, dinner. All right, I have escaped. That lab, that restricted lab, that's the lab with the saxophone on it. So pretty much everything exploded in there. Samus, we shouldn't have done that. You were ignoring orders. And that's when Samus gets all sassy and she talks back. She's pretty much been silent this whole game. in days yeah that's cool that's cool lots of lots of saxophones on the on the ship now there's about 10 of them <laughs> well yeah i mean the metroids probably didn't attack me because i have metroid dna in me so they were like oh you're just one of us Yes, more alone time. More time to think about things while you're just waiting in the elevator. I think that's a statement on like these elevator scenes is that they actually take so long that you can just think about anything. You know, I said I probably have enough E-Tanks, but I just, I want that one because I like having lots of life. Excuse me. Make the dude. 
make the second dude. All right, now you ready for this? You ready for the most ear-splittingly loud battle of your life? All right. It's Ridley. Ugh, that scream, dude. Actually, not sure what's faster, just shooting missiles at him or using the charge beam. I've no idea. But I'm gonna save my missiles now because I need them for afterwards. Yeah, that dude on the Game Boy Advance SP with its like one tiny speaker, if you turned up the volume all the way during that battle, it made the whole system shake. Yeah, the screw attack. I right, know this is basically the end game. Like, I have all the abilities now. I think. Yes. Um. Oh, I don't have to kill those. I just gotta bomb them all. So now I have all the abilities, and I can just go now. really should be a metal vocalist. Absolutely. The vocals get like pretty high, so probably like a ink diamond kind of thing. Do I need missiles for the rest of the game? I don't think I do. After this... For this, you just fight the... the final boss, and I think that's it. <laughs> so I don't need that missile upgrade up there. We're done here. We're prepared to activate, evacuate the station. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I know the X are they're bad, but the, but the, the government wants to weaponize them because whatever they want to or they want to like learn more about them, but they're dangerous. Samus knows that. Samus knows how dangerous they are, but the government doesn't want to listen about how dangerous they are. So when the government gets there, the X Parasite's gonna kill all of them. Just immediately, they're gonna learn everything about the Galactic Federation or whatever this thing is. The Federation. And they're gonna rule the universe. But Samus is like, no, I don't want them to rule my universe. Because that's not very democratic. That's not a democracy. We didn't vote them in. It's a dictatorship. They're like, I'm the ruler. You do what I say. If not, I'll just, I'll murder you. And the doors are locked. 
Open the hatch! That's so sassy. Yeah, the computer's like, we were told to confine you in this room. Uh, there's probably 50 saxophones on the ship now. Uh, so they're just going to come find you and kill you in this room. So that's cool. Samus, this is your last mission. Go to the operations room and you're going to... Oh, surprise. We're going to send the ship right into the planet. Well, Ridley actually has like no relationship to this game because the, the... I guess like the thing that was in the freezer that was like Ridley's like dead body that they just put in the freezer for whatever reason. I don't know. Um... But the ex parasite just like absorbed Ridley's DNA and became Ridley. Like, sort of like the saxophone. Like, it's not really Ridley. It was just an ex parasite that was mimicking Ridley. Like, technically, Ridley's not in this game, like, at all. He is just there to yell at you. Yes. All right, I am actually going to save the game right here because this is the last save room before the end of the game. And I want to see like my time on the main menu of like how quickly I got there. All right, this is the, the last bit. I'm actually like missing HP. What am I missing HP from? I don't remember. But I don't like super need it for this fight because it's not too hard unless you like get out of the groove of things. Dude, the saxophone is getting wrecked. can't copy these skills. You can copy my powers, but you can't copy me. I'm the one Samus. I am the galaxy's greatest bounty hunter. Saving does not disqualify. Dying does. Oh, wow. That was really fast. In fact, in my other speed run that was posted, uh, I saved like several times. All right, get out of here. Ah, oh, yes. Best theme song. Ridley's theme song is just the coolest. Oop. <laughs> this room looks like a hammer. I swear, if I had a better controller, I could do this, like, probably a bit faster. Just because of being able to control better. I know, man. I'm really hoping that it's, like, under an hour, but, like, shaving six minutes off is, like, actually, like, a lot. 
It's a Mega Metroid and my ship's gone. Blech, just straight to one health. <laughs> you can look up. You can make you can make Samus look up. Just like, uh, 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 uh. The saxophone is helping me. Saxophone help me. Blech. Now I am truly powerful. Yeah, that's right. Back up. Back up. Back up. Back up. Oh, boy. That was the fastest I've ever done that. Yeah, I got the ice beam. Yeah. I mean, I only got to use it for this, so. Whatever. All right. That's time. That's time. I'm pretty sure. I actually have no idea when the official count starts and then when it ends. I have no idea. I did it. Kitty cat explosion. Okay, since I'm pretty sure that this doesn't count towards, like, the time, I'm gonna, like, fast forward through it, so. I'm sorry if you wanted to read that. All right. God, that fast forward function is awesome. All right, let's see that time. Let's see that time. Let's see that time. Let's see that mid drift. Oh, look at that mid drift. Look at that. Look at that. What is the, what is the time? What is the time? Dude! One hour, four minutes. Look at that. Shave two minutes off. Two whole minutes. That's a PB, boy. That's a PB. Look at that PB. Boy. Okay, well, I did it. What time is it? Okay, I have enough time to, like, eat and take a shower before work. So, thanks for watching if you were, if you watched at all. Even if you're not here anymore. If you watched it before, thank you for watching. And I'll see you next mission. <laughs>